Hi, my name is Philip T. Hicks, and I'm from Memphis, Tennessee, and I know what you're thinking. With the last name of Hicks and me being from Memphis, I must be a real smart guy. And I want you to know that I'm a high school graduate, but they ought to make the sixth grade a little harder. And speaking of sixth grade, when I was a senior, I got beat up by the high school bully, and she was one tough cheerleader. You know, I couldn't find a wife with all her teeth back in Tennessee, so I went out to California and found me a wife. But they got some strange things out here. Did you hear about them cloning? They, they promised money for cloning things. Years ago, they cloned a sheep over in England named Dolly. And I don't care how much clone you put on a sheep, they're still going to stink. It's hard to be a hick in a high-tech world. How would you like to meet my grandpa Dudley from Arkansas and Elvis Hicks, my cousin from Tupelo, Mississippi? They're here tonight, and I'll go get them. They'll be right back. Hello there, my, my name's Grandpa Dudley Hicks and I'm from Arkansas and I'm a, I'm a carpenter. Any carpenters here? Yes sir, I make, I make two specialties. I make outhouses and I make coffins. My, my motto is when you gotta go, you gotta go. Uh, you know, if love means never having to say you're sorry, then marriage must mean never getting to say anything. I, I hadn't talked to my wife Mavis in over a month because I, I hate to interrupt her, and I can never say the things that mean so much to her, like, like, I love you, I'm sorry, look out for that truck. Hey everybody, my name is Elvis Hicks, and uh, I work at the S.O. Station, the S.O. Station down in Tupelo, Mississippi. You might have heard of S.O. because of me, because they, they say I look a little like Elvis Presley, but that is a matter of opinion, of course, but uh, when Elvis Presley, who was born in Tupelo, when he was a, just a young kid, he worked here at the station, here at the SL. I taught him everything he knew in the road to Memphis to become a star. It's for real. I made him a star. Why? Well, we used to sell live bait here at the station, you know, like minnows and worms and stuff for fishermen. And we used to slip live bait in Elvis' swimming trunks, and then he would swivel like that. Oh, yeah, hubba, hubba, hubba. I taught him everything in the road to Memphis. No, yes, for real. And then later in life, he started doing that karate. Wah! Yeah! Wah! You know, that wasn't karate. That was pumping gas down the tube blow. Uh-huh. 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 Uh -huh, uh -huh. In fact, when you invite me to come to your church or your corporate event, your family event, I'm going to turn three of y'all into Elvis Hicks. Yeah, hubba, hubba, hubba. With wigs and scarves, and we're going to have a good time. So I'll wait on your call here at the SO. Thank you so much for spending time with my grandpa and my cousin Elvis tonight. We would love to come to your next family event, your corporate event, or your church, and bring you some good, clean, wholesome comedy. So I'm looking forward to your call. Thank you, and God bless you.